New Jersey. XPW Invasion. Live November the 12th. The demon of fear. The man known as the soul no. The man known as the nigga taker will be taking on hard body. Casket match, no. But I can say I will have my body bag ready for you, hard body. Because once I'm done with you, you're going to be a dead body. Get ready, XPW. The nigga taker is coming. No souls matter.
Better than the thing on the toilet paper. It's a nice desk. Yeah. Huh. What? What are you? What are you? What are you looking at? What are you thinking? What are you doing? I'm looking for something for the man upstairs, for Jesus Christ Himself to give me wisdom. Because well, this fucking show. Yeah, not our best show. Not our best show. It was like just fucking pandemonium. Everything just imploded. It was like a fucking shit show. Think about it. Think about it. Are you ready? Think yeah. about it. Yeah. One. The mother of my children is the TV champion. How does this happen? What happened to psychosis? That's what I want to know. I'm hearing she fucking threw away the visa. No. Yeah. That's illegal. L illegal? I heard she found the visa. Well, she didn't find the visa. She got the visa, threw it away. No, Boom, in the trash. She, she wouldn't do that to poor psycho. I heard he was sitting at the airport for hours. Yeah. A two, I heard he was at the airport in uh, Mexico for two days. No way would she throw away his visa. She threw away the visa. She's not that, that mean. Yes, she is. That's number one. Yeah. That's number okay. two. The whole Vampiro and Masada thing. We go there. <laughs> I know. He hits you in the head with a belt. I know. I know. I listen. We go there to take the belt from him. We go to give the belt to Vampiro. That was a good decision. That's what I our know. Rick Schiffman said we should do. I know it was. But that just went to shit. I don't even know what the fuck happened. I don't even know what happened. It's not good. It's not good. That's our, our champion. Is, 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 then. Yeah. Then. Then. On top of it all, we get this rogue referee. Who would have known? Mega, mega. He wasn't a good referee anyways. I know, but now all of a sudden, oh my God, the fucking internet went crazy. He's up there. He's screaming. You got Necro. You got that whack job, Chad from St. Clair. And now we got a mega, mega faction in XPW. That's not good. That is like the... That might be one of the worst things that's ever happened in XPW. No. No. Want to know what the worst thing that's ever happened in XPW is? What? Drake Younger. Ooh. Yeah, that's not cool, man. Bro. Yeah. Proper pronouns. How fucking hard is it? Proper pronouns. If somebody wants to be referred to as a he or a she or a they or a them. Barnett. Listen. That's what they want. How fucking hard is it? If somebody says, you know what? I'd like to be addressed as my proper pronoun. My proper pronoun is they. You approach them as fucking they. You don't mock it. You don't mock it. That's wrong. That's wrong. You don't fucking mock it. It's they. Hi, I'm a they. Okay, they. Hi, I'm a them. Hi, you're a them. You don't mock it. Hi, I'm a cat. Yeah, well, whatever the fuck you are, you approach them, and now we have a fucking problem. That's a problem. A big fucking problem. That's what everybody's talking about. That's all they're talking about. They're talking about mega mega. That's not good. And proper pronouns. That's what they're talking about. We have to fix this. We need to take control of the, our company. Yeah, and yeah. This is, we... Listen to me. You need to go... Yeah. Stop. Yeah. We also got to get ready for this fucking Jersey show. We're going to New Jersey. Yes. I know. We're going to New Jersey. Real soon. And what's with that ninja taker? Uh, well, he showed up at the... Uh... Bro, I don't even know if we could... I, you heard what I... I said ninja, but that's not what... Other people are saying. I know. That's how he's saying. I don't know if we could use that word. I... Another... Now, on top of... Pronouns on top of Mega Mega. Now we have the. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Oh, fuck me.
of wrestling promoters or, or wrestling company owners that fall in line with that woke ideology bullshit. Where if anybody has a different opinion, a different thought, anything that veers off what they deem acceptable and right and pure and wholesome, then that person is not just a piece of shit, but they're evil. They're fucking horrible. They're monsters. The list goes on and on. Give me fuel, give me fire, give me that which I desire. Everybody's talking. Everybody's wondering, Drake, why are you here? Why is Drake younger in XPW? I have come to take what is rightfully mine, the king of the death matches. I am the uncrowned king for all that I've done in this business. And although I'm not just here for a payday, Rob Black did have to sharpen that pencil to get me to come here to California. But the fact of the matter is, Schlack, November the 12th. Extreme Invasion, Newark, New Jersey, you are a bad man. You are one of the baddest on the planet. You've run roughshod over this sport the past several years. But I am Drake freaking Younger. I'm the greatest professional deathmatch wrestler to ever grace God's green earth. There is one thing that you have to remember. Pain is temporary. Pride is forever. So is Drake Younger, November the 12th, Schlack. I'm in for the fight of my life, but so are you. Hi, I'm Drake Wirtz, Republican candidate for Florida State Representative in District 30. Let me take a minute to tell you about how I got here. I had my dream job, working for the number one professional wrestling company in the world. I led a very comfortable life and I thought I had it made. An issue arose on my heart. My wife and I dove into the world of fighting human trafficking. We wanted to end it however we could. We thought this would be a collective cause, ending modern day slavery. Boy, was I mistaken. The fake news and the Marxist left vilified falsely accused and falsely labeled me as a conspiracy theorist. Then, as the world turned upside down, another need rose up in our community. Our public school system started muzzling our kids, depriving them of oxygen, and indoctrinating them to think that America is a racist nation. Each and every single month, I stood next to the parents to oppose medical tyranny and defend parental rights. Along the way, I made some amazing connections with several freedom-loving Floridians, grassroots conservative patriots. So now what I'm doing is I'm picking up the calling that God has put on my heart. I'm here to work for you. So now I stand ready to end human trafficking in Florida. I will fight to increase the penalties for those who exploit children to life in prison. I'm gonna be your guy on the inside in Tallahassee. So go to votedrake.com, see how you can get involved, see how you can join the fight, and keep Florida great.
opening contest. Women's death match. That's right, that triple threat. That she was involved in. Call it, call it a match, you can call it a war. And her opponent. Right, either way. They have been chomping at the Big Cat Martini, and they are ready. They are excited. Their derby room in Pomona, once again, the home of XBW. Halloween in Hell 3. Never thought I'd say that ever again. Being that oh, She is the man day. from Nantucket, a walking song. episode of Cops. She is everyone's favorite fucking auntie because she brings the drugs and the booze Mickey Knuckle! Yes, indeed. She is everybody's favorite auntie. Oh. She's the auntie we all want to party with. Oh, my goodness. She's got that action. It's already for war already. Uh oh. Mickey Knuckle. Blue Dark Shaitan. Our opening contest. Women's Death Match. tonight as part of Halloween in Hell 3. One-on-one -on -one action, Lou Dark Shaitan, Mickey Knuckles, women's death match. As you can see, the weaponry already. Oh. And Mickey oh, Knuckles is giving uh, our ref here a uh, makeover. Mickey well, Knuckles for me. Uh, now the referee is uh, getting a little hardcore herself, but this is an official match. She's not in She's got her work cut out for her at the end of the day, and you can't play favorites either. Fuck her up, Mickey! Fuck her up! Oh, Delta! What the hell is this? What are they gonna do oh with my that? god! X-rated roulette, uh, black or red at the, at the roulette table? What is that? From the Hustler Casino. Did they get it from your closet? No. <laughs> They're drinking out of it. Yeah. What is that stuff? A facial. Well, that, yeah, that's, well, this is XPW. Now it's feeling more like the old XPW. Oh, man. My God. Can we rewind that? Oh, never mind. Replay. That's right, that's right. I'm recording it. And I get, okay. Uh, here we go. One-on-one -on -one action. Once again, fans, this is it. It is underway, Halloween in Hell 3, and the big stare-off right now between Ludark Shatan and, uh-oh, that's not gonna last long. No stranger, neither one of these ladies will back down from the other, or back down from a fight. I like the shots of Mickey Knuckles, I have to oh. say. Yeah, those come with some force. Off the ropes out, here comes Knuckles again. Oh. And this time, Shaitan goes down. Okay. Definite weight advantage from Mickey, Mickey Knuckles. And don't forget, it's not just a wrestling match, fans. This is a death match. Women's death match. We got the weapons, Women's we got the table. Death Women's death match. We got the, the light tubes in there. I mean, no, sh no shortage of weaponry. Uh oh, speaking of. It has begun. Look at this. Very, I was gonna say, has like a gentleman's agree, like a lady's agreement here. Uh oh, oh, look at oh. that! Right between the eyes! Way to start, show. Mickey Knuckles, I just think that angered oh. her! Oh my goodness, two of them! Shaton though! Almost, it's like it's enraging her! Look at this! We just started! I would be confused too. Look at it, oh no! And look at you can oh. see the glass sticking out. Oh, she's and, screwing it in. Oh, oh look already. At that. Oh, what a what a shot that was from the camera. You can see it. 
the, the, the laceration when it literally happened. Dude, oh! <laughs> Knuckles, desperation. Blue Dark, Shatan wants all of Mickey Knuckles' blood. Single leg takedown into a side headlock. And there's that hatchet. Oh, oh my no. goodness. This is hell. That's painful. She could, ki she could kill her with that thing. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh. Possibly a visit Monday morning to the old proctologist. Or, you know, hopefully an emergency one. To, yeah, tonight. hopefully before that. Yeah, hopefully she won't need that. There is glass already all over the ring. And there's still about 90% of these weapons haven't even been used yet. A few chops. Oh, reverse knife edge. Oh, open hand chop right to the face. Ludark Shatan trying to fight out of it. Headbutt, open hand chop. Forearm shot. And now Ludark looking for anything she can. Oh, those gusset plates. Oh, oh my goodness. She just headbutted a gusset plate into her chest. To the cleavage. <laughs> Now, if someone stares at her cleavage, I guess you can't get, you know, busted for that. You're literally looking at looking. the... Oh! Oh, no! Oh. All that weight oh. with that gusset She's plate. She's drilling it in. Quite literally. Oh. Drives the knee down into the gusset plate, stuck in the skin. Oh, that skin just Lose peeling that. off. Lose that. Lose that. Lose that. <laughs> My goodness. Shaitan now with the upper hand. And she's got those fluorescent light bulbs, light tubes. Look out! Oh, oh no! Right to the small of the back. And that toxic dust to boot. Insult injury. Knuckles, though, still trying to fight out of this. She knows that it's desperation time right there. If she allows Shaitan, oh, Shaitan, ruthless with those headbutts. But Mickey Knuckles. Fighting fire with fire. Now she's pissed. Oh, now she's enraged. In it for oh. vengeance. Pump handle. Oh no. Oh. All those shards of glass as she drove her down. Look at that face. That's a scary face. I don't oh, know. Oh my God. I don't know if she's my favorite auntie now. One. And the one count. Mickey Knuckles. If that face doesn't define Halloween and hell, I don't know what will. But we have a long night ahead of us, fans. A lot of great action coming at you as part of this tremendous card as XPW once again returns to the Derby Room, returns to Fight TV Worldwide. She's calling out. Oh, man. Oh, what? Suffocation. It is the old XPW. Chaton. There we go. There you go. Yes. More than I agree. It feels nostalgic already. Thanks to Mickey Knuckles. Thanks to Lou Dark Chaton. Thanks to everybody in the back. Oh my goodness, what a night this is going to be. What a night it already is. What a way to kick it off. Knuckles now. Serving. Look out. Oh. oh here we go. Shaton, though. Both these gals just fighting. Sheer will. Oh, no. Suplex right on top of those spike, those gusset plates again. I was out here earlier as we're going to take one more look at this. Standing. Vertical suplex, not only on the outside, but right into those. Oh. Four oh, gusset plates. Yeah. And you know what, some of the fans, they can testify. And we were all going around there, checking out the weaponry. They were allowed to touch the weapons, surveying it all. And man, oh man, don't take my word for it. It is the real deal. Ask the fans here tonight in Pomona. But more importantly, ask these two that are suffering at the hands oh, of no. one of Oh no, oh, oh no, oh no. God. No, no. That is on the top of the skull. My God. Oh, Cat Martini, have you ever seen anything like this? Especially from the female division. You know, I have to say, every time I see the girls, it's always something new. Oh, oh. And that is definitely new. Look at the blood. You can see the blood all over the back of Knuckles. Oh, right to that 
Wait. Look at this. Shaton. What's she trying to do? Negotiate with her? I have no idea. I've never seen combatants push through the pain the way these two are. So bad they want to get the upper hand on the other that it's almost like they're not even feeling the pain. Oh, oh, oh the already lacerated head of Mickey Knuckles now being sliced again. Oh, she is in trouble. Lou Dark Chaton, you gotta be impressed right now with Lou Dark Chaton in there I, with Mickey Knuckles. I am impressed, I'm nauseous watching all the blood just splat from her head. You know, but oh. hey, part of the game. Oh, <laughs> is it ever. Oh my goodness, to that ring post, smart move right there on the part of Knuckles, isolating Lou Dark Chaton. And that's what she may need to turn the tide here. Lou Dark Chaton though, holding her own. What do you call that? A crotch chop? No, I can't even call it a crotch chop. Whatever Mickey it's Knuckles a... wants it to be called. Yeah. Auntie Crotch? <laughs> Auntie Crotch. <laughs> Mickey Knuckles now talking some smack. But Shaton, maybe taking too much time, Mickey Knuckles was. Man, she looks lifeless right now. Those eyes were looking very dazed for a moment there on the part of Mickey Knuckles. As now both finally. Well, maybe, finally getting back into the oh, ring. No. Look at this now, representing. Oh, chokehold with uh, the Mexican flag. That's right. Well, Pride. Do it. People all over the world tuned in to check out. <laughs> Halloween in Hell free. New Dark Chaton, Mexico's own. That Show, bloody flag. Absolutely, showing her sense of pride. Oh, caught her right in the kidneys there. Taking too much time herself with Chaton. What does Vicky Knuckles have in mind here? Perching. Chaton oh. up on the near side of the, oh no. Oh no, now, oh, I think she heard me say crotch chop. I didn't hear her do that loud. Oh God. Man. What was she doing there? She is distracting Lou Dark. She's doing more than possible. that. Distracting her by violating her. Listen to this the, crowd. She just violated her. That was not consensual. Oh, drink break. Well, maybe she needs that. At the very least. She's got to rehydrate. Get back in there. And maybe some of that liquid courage, if you will. Uh-oh, wait a minute. Mickey Knuckles with that table. Don't forget, fans, the weapons all, look at that. We still have a chair wrapped in barbed wire, a steel chair. There's just so much in that ring right now. Knuckles, oh my goodness, relentless. Chaton dazed, and that table set up. Chaton though, firing with the knees. Chaton now, what does she have in mind here? What is that? Oh no, oh. it's it's the dildo. It's a BBC. Wait a minute, look out. Oh. Knuckles catching her. Oh. oh no, oh, well. Is that where I think it is? I think it is. What kind of she, wrestling match is this? She thought she was violated before. Takes violation. I don't think Fight TV's ever seen anything like this. Oh, massive headbutt, Shaton. How is she still standing? I have no idea. Or let alone fighting back. That upper hand. Like you said, Cap Martini, these two have been in wars with each other before. Remember that triple threat. Don't think they don't want at it. Both of them showing just how bad they want this. Just shows you right there how hard those light tubes are. You know, oh! But nothing was gonna stop them from breaking right there. Mickey Knuckles looks like she just went through a literal war. Hooks the leg, referee down one, two. Mickey Knuckles kicks out. How I have no idea. Both gals putting it all on the line in our opening contest What's here in tonight. The bucket? What's in the bucket? What is? Oh my goodness! Look at all that glass. I'm already hurting. Wherever that's.
it's gonna go. I'm already hurting in that body part. I'm hurting all over. Looks like a car wreck. Oh my goodness, those those are shards of glass. It's like the movie Die Hard. Kind of looks like the the guy who ran over a deer the other night coming home from the airport. And I must say that's what that when, road looks like. When was this? Last night. We, you want to talk about that later or yeah, now? I'll talk about that okay, later. okay, okay. I'm just saying that's I don't, what it looked yeah. like. <laughs> I, that, was, that was news to me as well. Look at this now. Oh! More chops. I think her shirt came down. There might have been a little... Uh, uh, oh, no. Uh, huh? Don't oh, talk about no. that. Wait! Oh! Again! The more, it's like the more Ludark punishes Knuckle, the more enraged she goes. Oh! oh drag her the glass! Drag, dragged her through those thousands That's and thousands of pieces of broken glass. Now I know what that dead deer feels like. <laughs> oh, oh. Still got to find out more about this dead deer in the airport. <laughs> Nonetheless, back to live action here. Back to our opening contest, believe it or not, fans. Coming to you from the Derby Room, Chris Kloss, Cap Martini Ringside, Pomona, California. Fight TV Worldwide. Irish foot, no. Loses control. Mickey Knuckles trying to fight out of it. Oh, puts on the brakes. Remember, she set that up, and she did. Oh, oh head first. And that table didn't budge. Look at the eyes. One, two. She kicked out! Oh my gosh, are you sure that's two? That looked like three to me. Referee said two. Udark Shatan obviously wanting it to be three as well, but apparently this women's death match, our opening contest continues at Halloween in Hell. Number three. This must be exciting for you, Halloween and Hell 3. Hey, you know what? I thought about it. You know, Halloween and Halloween, uh, Halloween and Hell 1 and 2, we had Dorco Dude here. We, we don't have him here at Halloween and Hell 3. It's kind of like how Michael Myers wasn't on Halloween 3. I don't know. Uh, this, I don't know. Yeah, a little bit of a stretch. I'm not, I'm not calling Kevin, Kevin Kleinrock an evil, uh, you know, killer or anything like that. But, oh! Oh! Man, she's just going all for it in Luke Dark's private part. Oh my, the violation continues! <laughs> and then some! What a sight! Big right cross! Into the table! Knuckles now! Oh! Oh, the gusset oh, plates! Oh no! Katon! It's gotta be, oh! Breaking her midsection, but you notice even when Shaitan goes through this, these, these bats of punishment, she fights back because she knows what it takes to put Mickey Knuckles away. Oh, right on top of those gusset plates again. Rolling on it. That, that heavily enforced table. So they can be used one, two. Was that two or was that three? Ludark Shatan. That was it. Call it, call it somewhat of an upset. But either way, like we said earlier, Cat Martini, you got to be impressed with that outing. Ludark Shatan, so impressive, especially in there with a female deathmatch wrestling legend and icon like Mickey Knuckles. Big, big win. Lou Dark Shaton kicking things off here at Halloween in Hell 3. Brought to you by Extreme Professional Wrestling. Welcome to Halloween in Hell 3. Yeah, I Dark Shaton's your first winner of the night. Absolutely right. Once again, Cat Martini. And my name is Chris Kloss, welcoming, welcoming you all to the third ever Halloween in Hell. It was back on October the 29th, 1999. What is Mickey doing? Uh-oh. We're getting X-rated in more ways than one. Oh! oh. I guess you call that good sportsmanship. 
when talking female death matches. Oh wow. Udar Shaitan. Not afraid to let it all hang out and then some. Fans, again, a special night. This now, fans, is the first XPW event since its return in this most recent incarnation of X. Oh. Oh. That is one bloody that, ass. That was very up close and personal. Sure was. Extreme Pro Wrestling, XPW, returning. So nice this time of year. I love the fall. These look so nice. That's Danny. That's Danny. I knew it. I knew it. I got a Texas and Rob. Fuck. I knew. I knew it. I knew he was up to something. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Some Newark Hotel. Oh yeah. Did you get the, did you get the message? Did you see the picture? Why? Look! 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 I was on 4chan. What? I was on 4chan. I found this. What the hell's 4chan? I was on other websites too. What other websites? Skinnet.net. What? Look, 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 look. Isn't that that one with the little frog, Pepe? With the. the yeah, yeah. Right? Yeah, that's not. This is not good. Look, 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 okay, look, look. Okay. This is bad. Hold, hold. Hold. Oh my god. I told you, that's him. It's Danny. He's an insurrectionist. Yeah. yeah. He was there. Look how happy he is. Look at him. What the fuck? He. He's an election denier. And it was a free and fair election. He how would you deny that? He was at the. Ca he stormed the Capitol. Is yeah. That is he? I can't fucking believe this. Dude, this is so not good. This is really, really, really bad. The FBI is gonna fucking come after us. Bro. This is really bad. Oh my God. Okay. First, Mega Maga, and now an election denier? An insurrectionist? <laughs> what, 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 what are we gonna find out next? That he's that he's against pro-choice? Nobody could be that bad. No, no. That's what he's gonna, soon, he's get... What do we do? I'm glad he doesn't work for us anymore. But still, but he does. He has a contract, bro. I gave him a con, there's no clause in the fucking contract for being an insurrectionist. There's no clause in the contract for being a mega mega, and there's definitely not a clause in the contract for being against them. I mean, bro. What do we do? What can we do? I, I, this is bad. This is really bad. And I should have known. I should have known because he's got like fucking nine kids. Suspicious. That's, yeah, exactly. That's when suspicious. you got all those kids, you're not fucking going for the abortion. You Never. fucking have the kid. You you're like, you fucking, you tell, you're like, hey, you have that fucking kid. It's called, for, you know what it is? Forced. It's called forced labor. That's what they call it. That's it's forced terrible. labor. Yes, that's that's him. Fuck! An insurrectionist. Next you're gonna tell me he was hanging out with the guy in the wolf outfit. Uh don't keep clicking. Holy fuck! I think they're at a Denny's together. It's it, it's over! Necro! Victorious, but but what was this? What was that all about? Danny Ramirez has called it down the middle his whole career. I mean, his whole career.
30 years in the bit. What in the world? What a sellout! Spray painting now. Putting up makeup. Are make you damn beaners and Mexicans and wetbacks and illegal motherfuckers? What are you thinking? He's a real American. She's a real American. I am an American. We are MAGA. I, MAGA! I, I, I can't believe it. I can't believe this. Danny Monchichi Ramirez. Uh, uh, an Angelino, I've known him over most of my life. A proud Mexican American. Wait, what is the meaning of this? Talk about an. He's like a, like a Hispanic Uncle Tom. But why? Fucking loonies on the left. You saw what just happened a few minutes ago. That is just a taste of what's to come. This is no longer Necro Butcher. This is the MAGA Butcher. And we are the Mega MAGA faction of XPW. We're here to make wrestling great again and make America great again. That's right. right yes. Baby. Yeah. Is that an American beer? Thank God. Did you say slack? Do you want slack? There's no God, only slack. Now you can wear slack. Get your slack t-shirt. The king of the deathmatch champion. Go to the xpwwrestling.com website and get your slack t-shirt now. Hi, I'm Will. Welcome to Extreme Gifts. Come on in, guys. Oh. Are you we have all kinds of lube for sticky situations. Boy butter. Huh. Stroke 29. Wow. Huh. And what do we have over here? We have male enhancement pills. So you can be as sky high as King Kong. Wow. And wow, look at all this freedom. I'm not totally sure what it's for, but it seems fun. We have all kinds of games for game night. Not for your family though. We have games like Oral Fun. The game of eating out whilst staying in. Hmm, I wonder what that's like. Sounds fun too. We have all kinds of nice outfits too for ladies or guys, I guess, too. And uh, wow, look at that. Be pretty nice to know a lady like that someday, huh? Eh, oh well. If you're looking for a fun weekend, we got all kinds of pipes. Wow, look at all that. Hmm, we got cartoon characters too. Hmm. And we got every kind of Snoopy I've ever seen in my entire life. This is my favorite section. Excuse me for a moment. And this is the section where I spend most of my time. This is the Wall of Dicks. USA Cox, made in the USA. We have all shapes and sizes. All shapes of colors also. We have tan ones, pale ones, extra tan ones, chocolate ones, twin ones. Whatever you need, we have it. Extreme Gifts. Are you feeling lonely tonight? You could have a date with Lisa Ann. Right at Extreme Gifts. Wow. I know you probably read about it in Cosmopolitan Magazine. Wow. We have the rose and stuff. Not sure what that does either, but people seem to like it. And for all you freaks out there, we got some stuff to tie you up and... Well, I don't know what else. Woo! Woo! Oh, these don't go on your fingers, do they? Oh, I, th these are cock rings. Uh, I think you know what to do with those. And look at these. I made these. I made these. Oh, you can buy stop. Get the fuck out of here with your stupid pins. We don't want that in the fucking shot. Cut. So come on down to Extreme Gifts. Our prices are insane.
Martini, what can I do for you on this glorious evening? Huh? Fur. 
Mm. Use your stuff, please. Yeah. How are you? Doing great. Doing great. Doing, doing better now. We, you got fur. Always, always good with fur. Oh, TV championship. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. I gotta hand it to you, the uh, psychosis visa thing. That was good. Touche on that. That was good. What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? What do I mean? You know, psychosis, the visa, conveniently disappeared. And that's my fault? That's more of like a mass republic situation? Mass republic. A mass republic. Well, that situation, my dear, uh, cleared the path so you could come out as the number six participant and, uh, well, win the TV title. That's just a conspiracy. Come on now. No. no. I earned this. Well, you know you're going to have to defend this. Yeah, but it's I have waiting. a plan. Go ahead, give give it to me. Okay, so you know in Hollywood, celebrities when they want to have a baby, but they don't want to go through the process of having a baby, like me who did it twice. Natural. Yes. They hire a surrogate. A surrogate. Yeah. So. I have a surrogate that's wrestling, not me. You're going to have a wrestling surrogate? Yeah. And uh, who is the surrogate? Seriously? Come on now. Who was my knight in shining armor when Willie Mac almost killed me? The dark Shaitan. The surrogate. Mm -hmm. Okay. The surrogate. Now, how does that work exactly? Like, does she... Well, we're out there. All right. She's with me out there. Okay. The opponent comes. I back away. Blue Dark does her magic. She gets to the end. I come back into the ring. Ten, one, two, three. One, two, three. Yay, Cameron Genius Still, XPW's TV champ. Everyone's going, whoa, they're the greatest day alive. Hmm. That's it. Sorry. Yeah. You're quite the influencer. Mm -hmm. I am. I am indeed. Hmm. Yes. Wow. Well, 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 uh, November 12th in, uh, Newark, New Jersey, you and your surrogate will defend this in an open challenge. Bring it on. All right, then. Bring it on. I am out of here. Taking the most beautiful belt in all of XPW. And the fur. It's her blanket. She's got to stay protected. Always. Surrogate. Blue dark. The fur.